in here, we have the kitchen where the meager food that is prepared for all the kids is prepared in this closed space. Your donations have bought this firewood. It enables the cooks to open on, cook on this open fire in this smoke-filled room. So one day I would like to be able to see us get some form of stove that pipes out and could mitigate the health problems that the cooks doubtless have because they have to inhale all of the smoke every single day when they cook food for these kids. And you can see an example of the food that we buy in bulk about four to feed the kids and that saves money and that allows us to go out and build more permanent facilities. Welcome to our staff room where we are studying with Father Sawano. It's where our teachers mark books and rest and take lunch. But as you can see, it's not a, a conducive environment because we have got openings there that need to be fixed. We don't have the ceiling. If we had a ceiling, we would be in a position to enjoy the, the warmth. And also, we would also want to have the cemented classroom. As you can see, the floor is so much scrap. But by the grace of God and with your donation, I am sure we are going to put everything in order. So I ask you to donate for us so that we can be in a position to do some renovation. Uh, we'll do a quick tour just to show you all the other classrooms that we currently have here at St. Irene's in Hawaii. This is where class five meets. And we see immediately that they've been working on their multiplication and decimal pages, tables. And right in front of us, poster the fruit of the Holy Spirit. Love, joy, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, humility, and self-control. There's nothing I could think of better that we could instill in our children in building up the kingdom of heaven than these very fruits. Here we have class four with a makeshift walls once again, same tin roof, and major gaps in the walls that would allow rain to blow in. We don't even have a proper desk. Here we've got a student just working on this makeshift bench, which doesn't even have enough room to fully put her notepad out. I know things will work out. Thank you. Good job. I thought that. Thank you. <laughs>